Hi! So I just went last week to New York City to attend Book Expo America, BEA. And how to explain BEA? It is a ginormous event. It is in a humongous building and there are thousands of people. There are books at BEA! That's like one of the best things is books. When people are asking me, what's your favorite thing about New York City? I said, I got to get lots of books and I got to meet cool bookish people. I got to meet bloggers. I got to meet librarians. I got to meet a few agents. I got to meet um, lots of neat authors that I had not heard of before and I got to meet some of my favorite authors and I got some signed books by some of my favorite authors and I might have fangirled a little bit about John Green because he was there one day he was there and I was brave enough to go up and actually start talking to him and I didn't throw up on myself and I even handed him a bookmark for my book and I felt a very yay go me moment right there so um, and he probably won't remember me because a lot of other people did the same thing, went up and talked to him. So I'm sure he was kind of like, ah, what's up with all these crazy girls? They came in a few different batches because every day that I would get them, I would mail them home to myself. So it took a few days to get them back. And I will show you the signed ones I got first because those are really, really excited about. I got the paperback version of Matched by Ali Condi, and it's all shiny and lots of specialness in there. And I got to meet uh, Allie and she is really, really nice and personable. Autograph from her. And it says, to Melissa, do not go gentle, Allie Condi. Because if you remember, do not go gentle into that good night is part of a poem in this book. Ridley Pearson, the risk agent. And he, Chris, take a risk, Ridley Pearson. Another Ridley Pearson book, Kingdom Keepers 5, and Shell Game. And yes, I got in line again for Ridley Pearson because he's that cool. And he wrote for Melissa, a keeper. Aww. I got Eventide by Tracy and Laura Hickman. It's a husband-wife writing duo. It's a book. It's a fantasy book about dragons. Signed. And there was a line there. And I realized it was for Shine. And the line, they were giving away 48 books. And I was number 40 in line. So I got a copy of Shine. And it's the third in the series of, so I, she signed it to me, Melissa, so great to see you at BEA. Fathomless by Jackson Pierce. This is an ARC cover, not final. Jackson Pierce. And the modern retelling of the Little Mermaid story. I got Princess Academy 2, Palace of Stone by Shannon Hale. And I love the first book, and it was a really great thing to be able to meet Shannon Hale. She is really, really sweet. She had pictures of her kids there, because I'm sure she knew everyone was asking, how are your kids? How are your twins? So she was very, very nice. I'm really glad I got to get in her line and meet her and get a copy of this book. This was the second book that I read since being home, since getting home um, at the end of the week from BEA. And I read it in a day because it was, I couldn't put it down. It was so, so good. I'm like, how is it going to end? So, um... I'm really glad that I got a copy of this. For Melissa, who is lovely, Shannon Hale. Aww. Shannon Messenger, Keeper of the Lost Cities. And I love this cover. Look at I me. Mean, look at the awesomeness. The detail here is so cool. To me, to Melissa, find where you belong. Love, Shannon Messenger. So I'm really excited that I got a copy of Shannon's book. This is the first book that I read coming home from BEA. 488 pages in this arc and I read it in a day because again it was one of those like what's gonna happen next how is it gonna end ah so this is the first in a trilogy and it's really awesome cake pops by Bakerella and it was so cute um I got to meet her her real name her real name is Bakerella if you didn't know her real name is Angie Dudley so that's who she is and she was really cute very very sweet so then this is the fancy dancy book. A little bit closer. Land of Stories, The Wishing Spell is the first book in the series. So there's just so much detail in this. So this is an I was able to go to a scholastic event on Monday night. When the event was over, they had a table there and they said, if you want to take any of these books that we have here, please take them, read them, review them, pass them on to other people that you know will like them. So Emily Rhoda, The Golden Door. Survivors, The Empty City by Aaron Hunter. This one we got at the Scholastic event itself. The Infinity Ring, A Mutiny in Time by James Dashner. J 
Jeff Hirsch was also at the Scholastic event. This is Magisterium. Oh, Soldier Secret by Marissa Moss. And some books I got for my five-year-old. Little People. Christmas is here. Little People. Let's go to the zoo. Star Wars, A Galactic Pop-Up Adventure by Matthew Reinhardt. Now, ready for this? This is so cool. Zing! Wait for it. <gasps> Did you guys see that? The lightsaber was blue and it turns to red because it's Darth Vader. And then there's all this other cool stuff here. All these things fold out and then they become other things. This thing here folds out. So let me just do one more so you can see the epicness of it all. So this is Anakin and Obi-Wan fighting here. So you can do a little... The Venice Conspiracy by Sam Christer. Got it. And it's just a little chap chapter sampler. So this is the next Artemis Fowl book, The Last Guardian by Ian Colfer. Three Below. A Floors Novel by Patrick Carmen. A League of Strays by L.B. Schulman. Cupcake Whimsy and It's a Cupcake Party by uh, Elizabeth Antoine and Elizabeth Cunningham Herring. A Kiss and Makeup by Katie D. Anderson. Skinny by Donna Cooner. Maggie Stiefvater, The Raven Voice. This was also presented at the Scholastic event. When You Wish Upon a Rat that's, uh, by Maureen McCarthy. Falling Kingdoms by Morgan Rhodes. It's a fantasy. The other books I got from Scholastic are Marty McGuire by Kate Mesner, the same one who wrote Capture the Flag that's coming out. Narc by Chrissa Jean Chappelle. Chapel? Chappelle? Got it signed to Melissa and she put a little sun. So that was Jake, Dad, and the Worm, written and illustrated by Martha Sears West. Brandon Mole has the Candy Shop War series, so I got book one and then he had book two available there as an arc and it's called Arcade Catastrophe. And he was really nice. And um, he asked if I wanted it, do I want it personalized? And I said, yes, can you write it to my son? He's nine. He said, oh, what's his name? And I said, his name's Calvin. So he wrote, hi, Calvin. And he said, and his son's name is Calvin as well. So he said, you have a great taste in names. And we're like, hey, I like you. So that's cool. I think my son's really gonna like these books. Galaxy Press was there and they have stories of the golden age. They're L. Ron Hubbard's kind of pulp fiction. Um, and so they gave me The Ghost Town Gun Ghost by L. Ron Hubbard on audio disc to review. From Scholastic, I got Stat, which is Standing Tall and Talented, uh, Double Team. This is an arc by Amari Studemeyer. Book two uh, of the Embrace series, Entice, by Jessica Shervington. Echoes of Titanic by Mindy Starnes Clark and John Campbell Clark, um, husband and wife duo. And so personalized to Melissa. Enjoy. I actually got a copy of Cruel by Jennifer Albin and wrote it up to Melissa. And she, Captain America joins the Avengers. Of course, I got this for my kids, but it's also kind of for me because Captain America is my favorite Avenger. And he wrote it out to my kids. Delia's Dole Day. An Incredibly Boring Story by Andy Meyer. Got it signed and then to my kids. I saw so many people at BEA walking around with these. Ah, L. Snicket. If you know Lemony Snicket, then you know that he wrote the series of Unfortunate Events. And now he has a new series. Yes, because I love his writing style. It's so tragic and funny and sad and awesome. So it says, thanks for visiting Stained by the Sea. And... Okay, in here I have all my my bookmarks and swag is what I, let me see, ah, I put all the stuff in here that so it wouldn't get squished from DEA. So let's put that, oh, up there. Hold on one moment. You get a lot of stuff at BEA. Okay, so all the right answers to all the wrong questions. This is very interesting. And who could it be at this hour is the name of the new book. So exclusive, exclusive sneak preview, and there is a calendar on this side, and a pen that has a little 
octopus that slides down in there. And it had a little thing of soap, which my kids took out and were actually using in the bathroom because it smells good. Thing. So, and then all my goodies inside. I received... I got a sticker for Infinity Ring. Find it later. So, um, Scarlet by A.C. Gowan. Gowan. And I met um, an author at the Editor's Buzz. She was seated at my table. And her book sounds really cool. It says, Will Scarlet is good at two things, stealing from the rich and keeping secrets. Skills are in high demand in Robin Hood's band of thieves who protect the people of Nottingham from the evil sheriff. Scarlet's biggest secret of all is one only Robin and his men know, that she is posing as a thief. Oh, I love Robin Hood's story, so this is really cool. And I went to a bookstore today, an independent bookstore, called Mysterious Galaxy for the first time today because I was down in Redondo Beach visiting a friend. And while, oh, there it is. Sorry, I just found the thing I was looking for. While I was down there, they had Scarlet. So, of course, I bought it because I have the bookmark. And AC Gowan, uh, Gowan, she was so nice because she asked, um, would you like a signed book plate? And I said, yes, I would at BEA. So I already have a signed book plate to go inside the book. So it's all happiness, togetherness, book love. Aww. So this book sounds really, really cool. Now I got hardcover. And I will put all the stuff inside so I don't lose it. I got a busload of other uh, bookmarks. So some of these are going to be for giveaways and some I'm going to give to the library for the summer reading program. And Fair gave me Books for Kids bracelet. It's the website, booksforkidscharity.com. So, oh, to go with the Cupcake Club. Where did the thing go? So they had little recipe cards there. Um, Juliet's Red Velvet Cupcakes. So that was very cute. All this goes together. My super awesome roommates, Tirza and Erica, sent me my big bag of books that was left over that wouldn't fit in my suitcase. So, and my husband's giving me the stink eye because we need to leave soon. So, uh, thank you. surviving high school. And I really don't know about this book. I walked past a, uh, a booth and they said, Hey, do you want this book? Why, yay? And I said, What's it about? And they said, Um, surviving high school. I said, yeah, okay, sure. Make Cabot Underworld. Rachel Cohn Beta. Gold Medal Summer by Donna Freitas. False Prince by Jennifer A. Nielsen. Burn by Siobhan Vivian and uh, Jenny Hahn. And I have it signed by Siobhan. Oh, one more thing. So this is from Black Dog and Leventhal Publishers, and they're letters that connect together. And this is great because um, my son is going to kindergarten, so so you can connect them together. Map this way. There we go. And so my son spelled his name. His name's not Map, but I'm just grabbing letters. So. Um, this is a really neat thing. And then on the back, they have it in lowercase. So that you can have them spell their name correctly. So when they, oh, the Infinity Ring poster. I got the Hobbit movie poster. So one other thing I got in my mailbox a while ago was I had uh, vlogged before about Robin Jones Gunn and that I love her books. And I had talked about that I didn't have book one. Well, she is just the most awesome author ever, and she had her assistant contact me, and she sent me book one, Peculiar Treasures, of the Katie Weldon series. So, now I have one, two, three, and book four is coming on its way, because that's on sale now. So, um, thank you so much, Robin. That means so much to me that you actually watched my video and that you sent me a book, because I love books, and I love Katie, and I love this series. So, any of you that need a really awesome series to read, you could read the Katie Weldon series by... Oh, by the way, by Robin Jones Gunn. She has a lot of other series. I have a whole bunch of other books by her up here. So, um, so thank you, Robin, so much. Thank you for everyone who made BEA awesome. Could talk about bookish things to people. I would often turn around in line and talk to bloggers and librarians and teachers, and we just talk about books and all kinds of bookish goodness. So it was really awesome, and I got a lot of books. So. I will be reading a lot and I will be reviewing a lot and my husband is saying it's time to go because we're going to see a show tonight. Um, our friends are in a show. 
So I will talk to you all later. Bye. The purpose of this video is not to brag about the books that I got, but is to share them with you guys. So if you guys got similar books, let me know if you like them. If you got different books, let me know so I know what to add to my to-be-read pile.